Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, my goodness, what a powerful introduction that was. I just can't, can't imagine that. While the introduction was going on, I, um, my mind went back to my early days in Monticello, Mississippi. There's no way I could imagine standing in front of such an audience as you today. There's only one thing there, maybe two, two, my parents obviously, but the other one is education. It's the only explanation that I can think of that could make that transformation possible. Graduated from Jackson State, laid out opportunities for me that I would have never, ever imagined. I didn't want to do all that. I just wanted to be a football player. <laughs> but at Jackson State, I realized the other opportunities. I met people who coached me about other opportunities and guided me to other opportunities. And I thank them so much. But before I go farther, let me, let me, let me stop now and thank Blake Wilson and Robin Robinson for providing me this opportunity. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Governor, thank you for your leadership and thank you for helping us uh, with our great institution, Jackson State University. Now, I know you expect, well, before I go, let me uh, introduce, I'm, I'm accompanied today by several administrators from Jackson State. Would you please stand so people can see you? The officials from Jackson State University, where are you standing? Standing. I'm, I'm in about my fifth week there. Oh, you're good. And it's been many, many years uh, since I've been to Jackson State. I could hardly recognize the campus. I've learned a lot since in these five weeks. But I've learned to respect the great, unbelievable leadership that we have at Jackson State University. You have some great, great people there who are committed and willing to work hard. There are also some challenges. And I know you've read the newspapers and you understand those challenges and I'll need to go over them again today. But I do need to just commit to you that you can count on us facing those challenges head on, front up, and overcome them, and continue to have the promise of this great university go forward. Because I believe Mississippi needs Jackson State University. The city of Jackson needs Jackson State University. It puts millions of dollars in this economy. It provides thousands of jobs. It provides many people the kind of opportunities I had when I graduated from Jackson State. And not only what it's doing now, but what its promise brings us. It's a hidden treasure. It's a place that we can go to and catapult us further into well-being in the state of Mississippi. I invite you to join me and the others at Jackson State to help us find a way to put that university in its rightful place as a leader among universities of its type in the United States of America and indeed in the world. That potential, that potential exists. It's there. And I'm excited about the people who are there. The commitment of the young people, and I might say somewhat old people too. For example, I ran across a gentleman, I'm looking for his name now, that um, works as a nurse uh, in Embry University in Atlanta. Wanted a degree to go farther. Enrolled at Jackson State. 
Thursday afternoon, he gets in his car and drives to Atlanta, puts in full-time job work there. On Sunday night, he gets in his car and drives back to Jackson State for his afternoon classes at Jackson State. And he has endured that grueling schedule for two years and finally agreed, got his degree. There are many people like that. People who are coming back to school and getting opportunities that they would not have gotten otherwise and having the same opportunities that I had. So this great research institution has the potential that can go forward and the power under that, the wind under our wings is sitting before me today. It is you. We invite you to join us, guide us, support us, help us find the potential that exists there and bring it into reality. Because we're not just talking about an institution for some of us. We're talking about an institution for all of us in this great state of Mississippi. I'm so happy to be back here. And let me tell you how much I appreciate the way that I've been received. Almost like the prodigal son. <laughs> I'm just amazed. And I'll tell you something else, too. One thing I've learned about Mississippi in these weeks, this is the Googlingest place I've ever been in my life. <laughs> Walk into a grocery store or a restaurant, and I can't get out of there for bumping into people who can tell me all about my history, things that I've forgotten about. <laughs> Where'd they get all that information from? I have a great story to tell about Jackson State. Obviously, the 10 minutes here does not provide me that opportunity, but I want to tell it. I ask you to invite me to come by your place, or you come by my place. Let's talk about the future of Mississippi. Let's talk about the future of Jackson State. Let's talk about working together and making that reality real. Thank you so very much. Thank you.